Hey guys, Anthony here for D News at CES. I got Shannon Morse with me from Hack 5. Hello. Hello, and we're hanging out in the fitness area of CES, which you wouldn't even expect to be an area. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> and we're talking <laughs> so about uh, the qualitative self is a big trend here, which is that thing where qualitative. you know you wear. Yeah, so you wear something like you've got a Fitbit on, or oh, I'm wearing yeah. my Fuel Band, and it tracks everything you do throughout the day, reports it back to a smarter app, and lets you track your fitness and your health. 4,000 steps already. Bam. Wow. How that many is calories insane. is that? Let's see. Oh my gosh, 894 calories. I am doing good today. See, and that's that's what's cool about this is that you it takes willpower out of it. Yes, it, it makes really it does. a game. It does make it a game. And all of these have social networks built in mm. so you can get competitive with your friends. Super fun. So these go from kind of like very simple needs. I would say that the fuel band is on the simpler side. It's just yeah. kind of like steps and activity and social and that's it. And they range all the way up to kind of what you're doing with the Fitbit. What does the right. Fitbit track? So the Fitbit One tracks not only your calories burn, how many steps you take, but you can also see how many stairs you've climbed and you can see how you're sleeping. So for example, yeah. the first night I got here at CES, I woke up nine times. <laughs> I'm a very light sleeper, apparently. That's so crazy. I would never, you would never know, because you don't even think that you woke up. And then, if you're like a really serious athlete, Polar has Polar, like a watch that yes. does everything from heart rate to it altitude. Even has a, it even has a GPS tracker yeah. built in, and you can track like all of your routes online. It's and crazy. I, I love it because even if if you're just starting to think about getting healthier, or if you're somebody who's like really at the top of their game and just yes. wants to get that much better, there's something here for you. Speaking of which, <laughs> yes. have you seen iBits? No. iBits has all these cool little devices for kids. Great for America, right? Yeah, was, oh yeah, I've seen this, where uh, in order to play a game, <laughs> their playtime on video games is directly connected to how many steps they've taken throughout the day, and it will not let them play any longer. I think I our country that. might need that. Where do we think this sort of thing is going in the future? What you are know, the implications I really hope, of this? I really hope that they improve the accuracy of some of these products because some of them are only like 90% accurate, 75% accurate, which is really bad in this market. But I also want to see the sinking get better. I want to just not even have to think about the calories burned or not even have to think about the food that I've eaten. Things I want like to that. not even have to check it and then not exactly. think about it. And then I'll just get fat again. No. <laughs> Very cool. If you had to pick one of these for yourself right now, which one would you pick? Um, I would probably go with the new wristband from Fitbit because it not only sleeps, does the sleep tracking, but the calories burn, and you don't have to think about putting it on your wrist at night. Very cool. Very cool. I, I might stick with my fuel band. I think it's good enough for me. What do you guys do to track your health? Let me know down below, and uh, please stay subscribed here because we got more from CES <laughs> all week. And Shannon's here, too, yep. for Hack5 and Threatwire. Hack5.org and YouTube.com slash Threatwire. How many steps do I have? You're winning. Woo! I yes. don't want to talk about it.